Well, it's fantastic to see you all again. Welcome to the next episode where we are depositing the agility bobblehead to the collection here before heading off to the endurance one in Poseidon. I have basically offloaded everything. I don't Hope think Nick has anything. Sin. Let's see. I'm all Nick thankfully isn't carrying anything. Previously we did basically complete the Atom Cats garage. So it's time to go over to Poseidon Energy and clear it out. Ah, uh, Poseidon. So we have two options. One, we can go through the sewers, or we can go guns blazing through the front door. Uh, the front door does require a master lock door. Or, or, the terminal's already open. I thought the terminal was a master lock. Strange that. Anyway. Yes. And we're in. What I'll do is I will exit out. The drain entrance. Hello, little novice. See if I never knew existed. The things you That's find it. just lying around. Okay, so we want what in here. First day spawn of the episode. Nice. Okay, we need to be pretty good at this. So. Try's been reset. Perfect. See, unfortunately, you won't be able to get the far right one there. Just the way this system works. I need to do that video on the terminal soon. To help people who might be coming to this game once the TV series comes out. Because, of course, that's going to drum up a lot of interest for the game, as you'd imagine. Sweet. Read me. Don't touch anything. Use the roof access. We don't want this floor waking up too. Cutty. Plenty of ammo because of our uh, dealings with the Atom Cats. I was able to negotiate quite a lot of armor. As for, as for them, there's a lot of enemies in here. Hello. See, because of the mire lurks coming from the basement, they've kind of closed off everything that wasn't. Oh, what? Unidentified intruder detected. Beginning search. You gotta reload sometime, well, yeah. So they use all them to keep the mire lurks at bay, essentially, because if we went through the basement, you would have learned that uh, there's a lot of them. Standing down. Ooh, we're standing down. Is that because we have become. Extra <laughs> So yeah, if I get Idiot Savant triggering on a random quest, or a main quest, it'll put me up at least another two levels. Hold it right there. Ah. Oh, I got hit by someone. Oh, no. Oh, I think there wasn't a way to control all the protectrons, turn them to our side. Or the turrets. Matters very little, though. Alright, now, you, you take cover and fire. I'm going to flank around the edges here. And we'll get them nice Got and it. good round the side. What do you have food though? Haha. -ha. Don't know what you were gonna trigger. You really want this to be the last mug you see? <laughs> you tell them, Nick. Tell them what's going on. Oh no. Mess issue for us. There's not as many enemies here. Oh man. Drugs. I don't think this is probably meant to be one of the toughest places to take down. Well, we've kind of breezed through it. 
Hi, dog. Hi, dog. Oh, Connie. Good that you joined me. Ooh. Job cutting and giving me everything that I need. You killed him. Don't quit, do you? Nah, I'm pretty consistent. By the way, this is entering like the 42nd day of this series. I have not missed an episode. Which is pretty awesome because I'm not even doing this full time yet. Collection or something. What's no, that? that comes 23rd June. That is when I go full time at this. So that'll be fun. 23rd June 2024. Yeah, I remember the year. In case anyone's watching this way in the future and they're like, ah, oh, you are full time. But yeah, it was a bit of a. Hopefully it's it's, it's the dream at the moment. Let's see how we progress with it. What are they shooting? There's no way they're shooting me. They must want to protect something long or precious. Bingo. Now, this is awesome because the endurance increase not only gives me health, but just, uh, you know, AP points and whatnot, so... Can't be bad to that. Man. Hell yeah. Energy weapons get 5% extra crit damage. Way. And that'll stack with a few other perks that we'll be picking up later on down the line. So, though we're not running a energy weapon, you know, build, still, it's good to have them all. What? What were you firing at? That's what I want to know. Oh, what a finish. Nice! I love that. <laughs> oh. Reduce damage while sprinting. I'm sure there's some build that that would fit in just like lovely with not mine i'm sure there is one <laughs> right not too much left of this building to clear through and it seems the majority of what remains is just goodies you ever wonder the difference between the abraxo and the industrial one is i think purely comes down to uh Adhesive? Is it? No, it's not adhesive. Uh, right, Abraxo. Junk. Yeah, so it just doubles up. So you get two fiberglass, four antiseptic, and two acid instead of the normal amounts. Uh, which obviously makes it a great thing to pick up whenever you can. I mean, we're in this room. We picked everything up. I think just the roof neck, and that is us. Well, roof, and then we'll go through the back way. Can I make a lot of stuff? Buff tats. Adhesive, cloth, glass, and oil makes a Molotov cocktail. They're pretty gnarly looking, aren't they? And then cutting fluid. Yeah, we'll have to remember we can craft a lot of stuff. Get us loads of XP as well. And my next question. Is this going to put me over the limit? No. Good. Ooh, jet. The jet put me over the limit. Serious? This is the world we live in. I'll put the combat chuck on there. It never really breaks into anything too useful. Alright, riff. Let's go. Oh, no. Damn. oh my god! Ah! 
There's more use up here than there was down there. Oh, stop. Oh no! And lastly, your helmet belongs to me. Not that it's an option. I didn't want that. Oh, yeah. Alright, hopefully there's a workbench, weapons workbench or something up here. That would be, be ideal. Everything you see here is just full of nasty, nasty mavericks. A big wide catwalk, anything just around here. No, it doesn't seem to be too much going on around the catwalk area. So we'll pick up what we can from all these people. Sure, you had a combat rifle. Oh, wonder where it went. Anything above us here? Don't appear to be. Nope. Nope. Okay. So, as I said, I want to show you the uh, the Marlurk bit. We can exit out that way. And now I'm wondering why. Well, the reason you don't hear a peep, Nick, is because, well, we killed everyone. Mm hmm. Nick picked it up. Anyone you walk away. Talk about collecting dust. See so on the sub levels. I think it'll be a little confusing from time to time. You know what, Nick? If you could just come here. Hey. No. And take. No! What did I give him there? Give me Silent Night. Well, see back. what I can do. Don't, don't, don't you think you can take Silent Night on me? And identify yourself. <laughs> hey, what should start with down here? Good. So, this good is gear what here. two centuries without a good dusting looks like. Nick, I'm amazed you're still here. Like, I thought we would have finished you by now. Like, in terms of quest, perhaps that's something I should do. I'll make a, a considerable effort to, I don't mean in a bad way to move him on, but, you know, it'd be nice to get a different type of commentary around here. First things first, I'm going to absolutely wipe out this.
you can on occasion. It is brilliant when you get it to where there's basically like no choices. I'm in. Well, it has to be this. Uh, the goddamn Marlux triggers triggered security down here. Use Ruth access. Oh, so they know security's been triggered, but they'd rather just not deal with it. So use the top one. Makes sense. Oh yes! Oh no! Fire till you see the white in their eyes talk. Look at this. The junkie's harpoon gun. That's the second junkie's item we've received in uh, a while now. Now. Underwater. I don't remember finding anything under here before, but it's what else you got? definitely worth a wee look. Never know. Oh. Oh. Hi there. Oh, there's a lot of cement down here. Did we kill them all? Looks like it. See, I definitely need to get some more I need to go hunting for rad stags that that's something on my uh, to-do list just throw that shotgun that's where a lot of that came from and we don't need it clear through all this and I think He just burst into bits and pieces. Right, one thing I do need to do, just want to stay remember. No, I have to drop something else. Right, there's some more silly stuff. Right, stop picking stuff up. Right, that's that's where I'm at. That's where you exit out. That's how we get out of here. There's anything back here, but yeah, it's worth me. No. I'll put myself over with that. Oh, it has fiberglass. Drop the hammer. Hammer's useless. Don't need it. No way. Right, let's get out of here. Back in through the crack. we go that's us into the commonwealth once again and uh, ne next somewhere he's with us okay so 
with that. That's another bobblehead down. We'll do uh, Spectacle Island next. First, and drop everything home. A very endearing moment. This is the 17th bobblehead, I believe. This leaves us only three more. Sans one. Small guns, which is in Gunners Plaza. The Sans one is in the vault in the Malden High School. And Spectacle Island as the luck one, which I so desperately need. Also, if we want Warwick unlocked as a settlement, of course, we're gonna have to clear out the Gwynnet Brewery. So we'll have to combine those two. Not that it matters all that much, because I'll probably want the castle. Um, set up a settlement before that. But, it is time to go swimming. Over to the mysterious Spectacle Island. The story goes, uh, this belonged to an eccentric billionaire or millionaire. Suppose you need to be a trillionaire given the inflation in uh, the Fallout universe here. Uh, had his own private island and, uh, yeah, it was meant to turn it into some sort of retreat. He got partially there. Nick. Prepare yourself. It's going to be quite the fight here. The king, he's not a problem. He was easy. That's what comes next. So Randy's dead here. And it appears that his uh, little shack was ravaged. Although... There's a dead raider, so one would blame him right away. Which, I could imagine, you would assume that. But in order to get this settled, we need to power it up. Powering it up's the easy part. We do it on this ship here. It shouldn't be too much bother. There's a fat man, so I should tell you all you need to know about what's going to happen in the next few seconds here. Mm, turn on the circuit breaker. Oh. Less good, but good news is we have ba -da -ba 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 -ba, 29 of these. And the polisher off. There we go. Luck bobblehead. There's only one way to give 110%. <laughs> yes, four leaf clover. Awesome, we find. Steamer trunk full of goodies as well for us. Take that all. Plus, anything else we find lying around here. So it's funny, part of this place is actually. Nick, <laughs> get chased by a Part of this place is actually provided from a generator of this old ship, which, uh, if that's not making good use of uh, resources, I don't know what is. I remember doing a playthrough where I had to kill this in one of the Christmas or the Christmas live stream. Man, oh man, it was a tough cookie to crack. That well, we did it in the end. Now we can follow this, which we just turned on. We're not sure why as of yet. <laughs> oh, we got we level up. Woohoo. Now, the plus one from the bobbleheads also gives us like an additional rank of both the endurance. So we can take rad resistance, which to be honest, we probably should have that near max when we're dealing with the glow and sea. Um But still. Uh where's the explosives? Demolition expert. Yeah, I would like explosives to do double damage, so I probably will end up picking one more in perception. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Tell you what, that is actually a pretty. Cr you you can get some serious dumb luck when it comes to all these perks. And then the ricochet just sounds ridiculous. <laughs> What's that there? 
Robotics expert? And the cam G take last 200% longer as well. Nice. I'm actually not too sure what route we take from here. Well, we don't need melee mods because we've already kind of got a good bit. The path to your closest quest target is displayed in your vats. Gain two perception. What? Two perception would put us all the way up to the robotics expert. Hey. Pretty good. Commando maxed out. Here we go. We now have this. This is now the strongest weapon in the game. By far. Signal checklist. Make sure the wires to the generator are connected properly. Last thing we need is another short blowing out the generator, Randy. The generator must be on before turning on the signal tower. I suggest you stay out of the water when flipping the switch. Just saying. You'll know the signal is playing well. You'll just know. Once the feedback goes away, it'll sound like nothing coming out of the speakers. But, or there is, but only the Marlurks can hear it. Look at the damage in this. an awesome perk like <laughs> yeah so if I was to redo this again I would invest early in damage and idiot savant both are good uh, we've also got pretty rad looking settlement now not bad thankfully no one's here yet so I don't even know if I want to connect it might turn into a home base although starlight driving is pretty much up uh, up there for that what the There's an enemy here. Very. I'll be doing the world a service. Come on, fight me. Where is it? Hello. Come on. Come on up the land here. Don't run away from me. You're the monster, not me. Ooh. Perhaps that was your plan all along to lure me in. Plus two luck. Walk away. I don't know what I'm cur what am I currently wearing in my chest piece. Ah, uh, plus one charisma and intelligence. Hmm. Plus two luck. It's it's a great alternative, I'll give you that. I'll put it down. Put it down is something I could try, but I'm probably not. Seems plenty of supplies washed up here. So we can even get up to the next level. <gasps> a kitchen skill. Accounting for taste. What I've always wanted on the untouched oven mitt. Okay. Ooh, are we shy? What's shack a lacking? I don't know, it was terrible. But. Damn it! I was so close. This one certainly made me work for it. 
I thought it was a sunrise? No? Oh no, sunset. <laughs> Loads of settlers here. Damn. Guess they tried to make this place work before they turned on that signal and attracted every mire lurk within a mile radius. That is probably the largest. Uh, is this the largest build radius of anywhere? It feels like it. It's huge. Did you make a plane? I don't know why it wasn't made bigger. Wonder can you get like? Can you build like quite, quite high vertically in Jamaica Sweet. plane? Because saying that could kind of offset the awfulness of the size. Maybe. Building turpentine. Guess at some point there. Oh no, there is a table there. I just can't see it. It's invisible. It's in a different light spectrum, so I can't see it. That would cause the damage here. A mini nuke and then an undetonated one hit. Would explain why there's partially, partially some of the house left. Almost cleared the island out. Have a look at these ships. Must have been the ships of the settlers that came here. Looking for a new life. Did I just... Hey, hold on, hold on. Did I just pick up a nuke of mine? I did. See too many of them. Nice. Awesome. Well, this has been a very profitable engagement. And we have the luck bubblehead to thank for it all. Let's throw my stuff back and see where we're heading to next. And another one deposited. We have two left. And as I said, I know where they are. So, how about we go and get them from the Gunners Plaza? I'm going to jump over to Vault 95 and we'll cross over the water here and uh, see what all we can encounter on the way. Whoa! Forgot these guys might respawn. I'll bring them out to me. So close. <laughs> what? These weren't, <laughs> these weren't slow and respawn. Really <laughs> he mutated. He proceeded to die like the rest. Not that it's an option. Another chameleon armor. Take everything off you, why not? What's that? Yeah, that 
one way to get that cool and pumping. Tell you what though, good wee place to just farm assault trons, I guess. Remember we were all here? Here with Kate. That was that was good fun. Good times, good times. Okay, so Somerville is where we're heading to now. On our way to Gunners Plaza. Oh yeah, this guy. Oh. Good bit of cement. So when we unlock this, he opens. You know that sentry bot's making an yes. appearance here. Yeah, that makes sense. Very profitable engagement, I must say. I haven't been to this wee unmarked bunker in ages. Ah, oh, it was definitely, it was last year it was in the series. We'll be making an appearance in the much longer video where I do. Um, I'll be doing the glowing sea in areas just up to the Charles River, so it will, of course, include like that bunker and the statue that's uh, not too far south. North. Get my directions mixed up there. Anyway. 260 XP for that. Not on. Let me use your workshop. Did the Minutemen send you? Yeah, they did. Yes, I'm here to help. What's going on? There's a group of raiders that won't leave us alone. High Stealing our food and supplies. Okay. Threatening us if we can't give them what they want. We know where they're coming from, but we can't stand up to them ourselves. Don't worry. I'll take care of those. I hope so. We didn't know what to do. Okay, Hyde Park's been added to the list, so the southern part of the map is going to get a lot of loving. Something else. I just really wanted the Ragstag meat. Red stag meat. Where? Ooh, little sniper's nest. We're getting all sorts of unmarked locations today. Waiting for our guests to jump up. I definitely thought there was Marlark hunters. Oh yeah, they, they've just appeared. <laughs> They'll fight the ferals for me. The fight, I mean, distract very briefly. <laughs> Someone's hey, coming. Causing quite the ruckus there. Oh, a oh, minute, man. With a very nice rifle. You got him there, Nick. Good, good. We lab at the back of this car as well. Be sure to never take any burnt books. We've done that. And we can head a wee bit further east. Follow the train tracks all the way up to yours truly, the Gunner Plaza. Remember we sent that eyebot in like episode 15? Mm -hmm. I'm tacky as well. These don't seem to be worth the trouble. Yeah, we sent an eyebot to here to pick me up a nuka grenade. What? Never kill them without them blowing up. Just not that, you know. I don't have. Oh, I suppose I could use like a critical vat at some stage. But what a what a random place to just have a super mutant just sitting. Just 
Got a few wee places we can explore down there, as well as power armor next to yet another downed vertebrate in Murkwater. Knock knock. Nope. <gasps> Desk file. Well, ain't that a blast from the past? It's pre-war money. Can't say no to that. Brotherhood. Where on earth would you be going to? Oh, you come to attack. You're coming to attack here with me, aren't you? Oh, you are. Guard dog and all. Oh, this is about to be a brawl. Ooh. Well, turns out the Brotherhood have come to assist us. We'll clear the roof first with them. Whilst we've got all these guys distracted. Right, Brotherhood, don't don't crash your vertebrae just yet. Oh, they dropped trips off. Surely they're coming over this way. Well, it says novice door, so this must just be a wee storage area on the roof. I doubt it's gonna lead to anything. Sweet. Inside, nope, just a wee gunner barracks. It's okay. Explosives and meds. Ooh. Plus lots of ammo. Say, I'm just, uh, whoa! Uh, and that shots happen. Whoa! <laughs> I was a direct hit. Vertebrate's still alive, though. And it seems the backup is slowly making its. It's a mini nuke, isn't it? Oh my god! Who's wheeling that? Oh! Is anyone alive? Signed off! Where's the pilot? Where is the pilot? Or was it just a vertebrate? Well, thankfully, Turn that vertebrate sacrificed now. itself so that you don't have to worry too much. Ooh, we've attracted him. He can attack the Brotherhood from the rear. As a mutated one. Surprise! Oh no! It seemed everyone died. There. Obviously worked out very well in my favour. Wonder what happened to Gil. Did he, did he die? Did he run away and die? No, he is still very much with us. In fact, I don't think we're alone. Ooh, he took out the initiate. 
Okay, the initiate would have survived. I'll give him that. Hadn't I just attracted a legendary? Uh, over to him. We lost the entire Brotherhood battle party. They managed to kill every single gunner for us. Not to mention turrets upon turrets. I'm taking everything. Everything. Because I have. Hey. What's the plan? Well, the plan. Over Nick. here. John. The plan is to give you all of this. And. I don't really need to give you any of that because it looks like. I don't need to. And done. We pick up what was on this legendary guy. Yeah, same thing. Uh, I thought it was his plasma rifle. Got all happy there. I was like, yeah. What a haul. Still a pretty good haul. No, I'm not gonna lie. We've got full Brotherhood stuff, lots of gunner equipment. Um, I think there's a few on the roof I might have killed that I could have jumped down to snag. So, back up to the roof here. And then what I'll do is, and this might be dumb, but I'm going to do it anyway. I'm going to. Oh. Oh, he killed, oh, he killed everyone. Ah, there's the one that had the fat man. Hold on a minute. That's a nice little setup. Wouldn't mind one of these. Ah, ages. see, I don't only do things. I only like to scrap things if they have something extra to them. So, done that. No. GNM broadcast terminal. Tower status active. Gunner News Network. Ah, oh, that was the regard dog. So they really, they really did have their own little brawl up here. Whilst I was, you know, preoccupied. So I definitely didn't kill the gunner with the uh, fat man. Good thing I didn't have to deal with her directly. That'd have been a disaster. That's uh, down here where I popped this one. So we have easy access into the plaza. Well, you know me, I love looting, so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to fast travel out and come back. If the enemies spawn, I get to fight them over again, get more items. But I need to drop everything off, take everything off neck at the red rocket. Back in a moment. It appears no one spawned back, so... Lucky us, we get to just sneak right on in. And just start a bit of a firefight. This will leave us with one bobblehead left in the game. But after that, we get the joys of getting all the magazines. Wonders if turrets that we can control here, that would be useful. Okay, so try reset. Let's see if we can pick up a few more dodge removers. Right, I'm not seeing any more, so I guess we've got to... Okay, Born, it's got something in common, so... Band has one thing in common. Okay, what does Dan have? It's an N, and it has an A, yes. so it must be Dan. And we'll choose personality, we'll make them law enforcement. Powering up. Protectron on duplicity. Please don't help us here. I very silently. Very 
very simply walking in and being like, Hi, Goners, what's up? We'll cover your robot. Keep getting these synth legs. Like, why? Who, who wants them? Ooh. Tektron. Why do you be like this? Because he must have seen me attack. D didn't even click on that one. Okay, there's someone above me. Whoa, 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 whoa! Thankfully, forklifts don't explode. Else we'd be in real depths there. <laughs> oh, that kneecap there. And there's an Irishman. That would have been funky. That would have been funky indeed. Nice. Whoa. What triggers you? Oh, that that would have triggered it. Well, it took us many episodes to learn the hard lesson of the Winston uh, water treatment. But I thought it would be a particularly good idea to uh, walk past the tripwire that blew me up. Guessing the army must have took this over at some point. It makes sense. End of the world. Straight into the radio stations. What the? So since we've covered everyone here. Doesn't seem to be much here other than the gunners just using it as a bit of a ah uh, so this would be like the medical bit for them tell you what they're well organized killers i just wish you could join them just as an option like do you want to be super evil and join the raiders it just from the get-go being evil should just be an option i'm sure there's a good few people that play this and they're like do you know what i'm I'm role playing. It's the end of the world. Of course, I'll be a really bad raider. Uh, fond, no. Boys, no. Look, no. Rest, no. Because it's got an S and a T. Food, no. Band. That's it. It makes little sense about the turrets now, doesn't it? How would you have even sneaked around to that? Uh, the wonders. Okay. Bring me that pet boy. That's, that's what's coming next. Oh, the turrets. I mustn't forget the loot use. These military grade circuit boards are all the rage these days. Above us, then. Who? We're hot. GNN employee. Terminal. Okay. Message sent to Sam. Ha! 
I stuffed my old lunch in Jim's desk. He thinks it's Boris. He obviously doesn't open his desk too often. The lunch has been there for a couple of weeks now. Should we tell him? Gerald. I wonder are we going to find like moldy food in one of the desks. I thought I Not exactly subtle, Ooh. pal. You're telling me he's not subtle. He just walked up from behind us. I hit my job. Yes, management. I hope you're reading this. Not only do I get stuck in the corner, and not only does management somehow fit another desk next to mine, and not only does the light above me flicker throughout the day, and not only does the wall leak whenever there's a hint of rain, and not only does management stick in for an exchange intern in this already cramped space, and not only... Never mind. Boris, you smell. Yes, Boris, I'm typing that about you right now. Yes, I see you trying to read my screen throughout the day. And yes, most of the time pretending to work. Yes, you can read it even though you can't probably can't read English. Um, did I mention you smell? This is so bad, I hate my job. Apparently I don't have a name, so I don't know who what employee terminal this was. Uh, there's no moldy food in it, so I'm assuming that's not him. Hi Jim, my internship is almost up and I will be heading back home soon. I know you'll read this because, well, you'd do something like that. I apologize for making your life here miserable, but I do hope my absence will bring you some happiness to your life. Please don't forget what that you have a job that most of us in my country would die for, so count your blessings. Also, I'm glad you brought up the smell. I thought it was you this entire time, that's why I kept looking over in your direction. P.S. I read and speak English very well. Thank you. P.S.S. I use my heavy accent on purpose because it makes people like you think I'm smart. Take care of yourself, Boris. Oh, it's a pity there's no moldy food in any of the desks. Would just been <gasps> who would been a desk fan like that? Missed opportunity to put moldy food up. I I mean it. Would have been such a, a cool we find. Look through the office area. I wonder what's at the other. Oh no, that was the toilets in the storage room. Hey. I want this oh. one yes. What's that? Will be taking your combat rifle. And just anything else. I guess. Look, I know you're in there. And yes, I could unlock the master lock door. But no, I'm going to fight my way to whoever has the key. So I'm going to have to anyway. Why not? back this way. I suppose they all just would have looped round to here. Ah, ha! Barracks. Well, 
Anybody else? No, one more channel. Right, so whoever must have the key to that door, it must be up here. I guess I'm not gonna be able to change that. There we go. Yeah, it matters very little for the turrets. Are already dead. Who's there? Something out there. It's cruise I need. Want this one's head. Detection system must be on the fritz. You'd think they'd start to panic considering I've made it this far. So they must know just like the sheer amount of gunners I have killed to get to this point. Like, does that not put a wee bit of fear That's into it. them? Like, how often. Sure to have we listened to that. So if we had actually came in from the roof, we would have run straight into Cruz. Nick. Hey, here's what I've got. It's not what you've got, it's what I've got to give you. It's very eerie now. Aha! Uh -huh. Yes. I actually forgot about this. So, uh, Street Guns of Detroit. See, that's why you're very thorough. Then you find things like that. Anything behind the barricades? Any people a day trip? Chinese sword, 25% chance to disarm on successful block. You could probably play this game with a very heavy emphasis on blocking. Which I think is quite a cool idea. It says there's three enemies in here. So we'll save it before we go in guns what blazing. The? Let's see what the, I can someone be. 
Oh, is there like another Saxon or wind? What? Possibly have been hiding in here. Surely it's not just a wall safe. Got it. I can't say no. It's in the terminal. I keep hearing bleeping, you know, like a turret, but I don't see a turret. Not in here, is it? Strange neck, strange. We hear turrets, but don't see turrets. Anyway, it must be coming from here. Someone's coming. Don't worry, I do recall that I have to look at Perfect. Hank, you, 25% crits with ballistic guns, which makes sense. Get him, get my dog there. The mayor's office has Where's his hollow tip? No! I didn't mean to sit down! <laughs> no! Okay, so the last one is at the Malden Center, or not the Malden Center, the school. What can I drop here that I don't need? What What did I pick up that was so heavy? Heavy ass chest piece that I don't need. Let's read your terminal. We'll listen to the hollow tapes. Lieutenant Rand's plan to infiltrate the Hyde Park Raiders seems to be paying dividends. I like that. Not only are our spies providing valuable intel on the forces gathered there, word of our infiltration has led to a witch hunt among the Raiders. Plans to deploy a removal squad have been put on hold for the time being. I've encouraged our agents to continue fanning the flames. I suspect these Raiders might do the job for us. So who did we pick up? We first, well, we picked up Cruz's one. Let's see what Cruz had to say first, then we'll go on to Wayne's. Looks like the mutants have settled two mics north of here, taking over most of the town. They seem to be concentrated in the old Fallon's department store. I let a squad out a couple days ago to clear them out. We were ordered by Captain West to retreat when our squad was ambushed. When we got back, the captain chewed me out in front of the guys and then asked me to see him privately in the old recording studio. After reaming me out for several minutes, he took me off patrol and reassigned me to guard the HQ here. It's just so confusing. I mean, I'll never confront the captain in front of the men, but what is he up to? Why did he order the retreat and then blame me? Okay, so he was going to go clear the mutants out and then he stopped. What was Wes up to? We're about 
find out. Command, this is 429er. We have visual on hostiles near Fallons. Copy, over. 429er copy. How long before range? Command, we are two mics from range. Over. 429er copy. You are clear to engage when ready. Command, copy. We'll update as soon as we... Ambush! Taking heavy fire! 429er, you are to retreat back to HQ immediately. Do you copy? Over. Command, say again. Over. 429er, retreat back to HQ immediately. That's an order. Over. Command, copy. Pulling back to HQ. Out. Hmm. I wonder if there's more story to that. So what, just the, uh, everything went wrong and they pulled them out? Let's see, we'll take the elevator first, see where this goes. Today I learned there's a basement. Hey. Which I previously didn't know. You know about. One way to get that cool one pumping. Whoa, there is a lot more enemies down here. So how do we read up on Cruz and Wes's hollow tapes? There's no further information and I think there's a person called Ryder and if you pick up their hollow tape they basically say that it was Cruz's fault. So the conspiracies running rampant on the Reddit seven years ago basically suggest that uh, you know either Wes wanted rid of Cruz as he was a threat to him and that's why he ordered the retreat and kind of disgraced him. or another possibility could have been that uh, there was something at Fallon's that Wes knew about. That was a really good finish. <laughs> basement to this place so this is definitely on my did you know sort of list. Well there's Ryder. from that one bullet it took to kill you. I think you were in fact the one in trouble. Let's go to Raider. Listen to this, level Bruce up. Bruce got what he deserved. Captain West should have stripped him of his rank for what he did. He's soft and it shows in the many leads. We're gunners for crying out loud. We don't retreat. And his punishment? Guard duty on the top floor of HQ. Meanwhile, me and the guys are stationed down here in this dark, cold, shitty basement. First thing tomorrow, I'll have a chat with the captain and tell him how I feel. Who knows? Maybe I'll get reassigned and get to see some real action. Hmm. <laughs> oh, fur. Fur bit of a fallout, all because of, like, Wes telling him to retreat. Which, again, I still. Huh? I think that was definitely cut. There was probably more to it. Um, we just never got to see. Didn't hit it lucky there, right? So we'll start from here. This and this. Oh, serious? No more? Oh no, there's more. Except there's none to reset my tries. Damn it. Okay, let's see. Could it be cash? No. Could it be uh, Andy? 
No. Could it be Rudy? No. Busy has an S and Lone has nothing, so it's busy. Sweet. Okay. All for spotlight control. Yeah, he could run, but he's pretty much dead already, isn't he, Nick? Whoa. It's close. Oh. Yeah, turns out I didn't actually take as much armor as I thought. He's looking at this like, can he do it? Oh, he can. Okay. Okay. Nice. That's all we needed in here, Nick. Got way more than I needed. More, more interestingly enough, I, I've just never known this place to exist. Did not know. Scrapping your items so good, like just so the carry weight I get out of it. So I will admit, I used to always wonder, like, who upgrades their weapons at the end of dungeons and all. That's what Sweet. went through my head. I was like, I don't, I don't get it. Is it, is it for nomads that just, you know, maybe improve at the end of a dungeon or something? Nope. No, I was completely wrong. It is, it is for the reason of lowering your scrap count so you can go back and build settlements. In terms of a rank, we're taking the first level in sands, which allows us to build industrial water purifiers for our settlements. So we'll be able to ramp up water production pretty rapidly. Now, let me talk about what I want to do in the next episode. And once a strong word. I mean, so clear and hide park out for Somerville is on the table, but I actually want to go to the police stations and kind of get Nick out of the way because I will want to pick up Curie uh, for when we start doing more of the glow and see. I think she'll be a good fit for that. Um, or Strong. Or Preston. I mean, there is still a good few characters to get through. We've only fully completed Don Piper. We've done Kate. We've done uh, McCready. Who else have we done? I haven't done Hancock. No. We've got Nick now, so I suppose like a third of the way through most of the characters. There probably is someone that I've mistakenly forgotten for some reason. But anyway, this was a good wee fun episode. Catch us all tomorrow in the next one. Thank you for watching, of course.